I'm at home today. I've been a naughty boy, haven't I, Charlie? It's me and Charlie only here. Charlie, say hello to everyone. Charlie's got his pig that he wants to say hello to you. Has you got your pig, Charlie? Charlie's got his pig. He's, he's in a good mood when he's got his pig. So yeah, all weekend I've ate and ate and I got up this morning and I was aching even more. So I thought, no, nope, there's no way I'm going into work feeling like this. So guys, this is me and Charlie. Shannon's at work, Lucy's at college. So we're gonna cook a chili con carne, me and Charlie are, for my dinner tonight, get it all ready. Right, so there is our ingredients for a banging hot chili con carne. So we've got the mince, we've got the red kidney beans in chili sauce as well. Love them in the chili sauce. We've got an onion, salt and pepper, tin of chopped tomatoes, mixed herbs, some chilies, and I've just remembered I've not got the garlic out. Right, let's get cracking on with it. So I'm just blanching off a bit of onion, a garlic, a red chilli, a green chilli. I've added some oregano to it and mixed herbs. So we're just blanching that off to start with. Lovely jubbly. I tell you what, I wish you guys could sniff this because it smells lovely. Right, I'm just going to add the beef now, minced beef. So this week I've got another uh, promotion to do with the Tesco campaign. I'm just going to have a look in a minute at the recipes to decide what I'm going to do while I'm cooking the chili con carne, which is quite good because the kids are going to be here as well so they can help me and taste right, it. So I've drained the fat away. Tin of chopped tomatoes. Now what I'm going to do next is I'm going to add some beef stock, beef stock, a bit of chilli powder, right, so I've added the chilli beans, a bit of beef stock, some Worcester sauce, bit of chilli powder, job should be a good one. Let's let it simmer and see what it looks like in a little while. But you never guess what, I've made the chilli and I suddenly realise I've got no rice. So I'm going to nip out now, get some rice, that's my dinner for tonight. There should be enough as well for me to freeze in a container for maybe next week or the week after. And I'm going to get a tin of baked beans just to finish it off. I'll show you when it's all served, guys. Tonight's dinner is served and I've got baked beans as well in the chilli. Look at this. What do you mean, uh, wouldn't you eat that, Lucy? No. That looks scrummy. Nice fresh chilies in it. Have we got to loads of toilet paper? No. <laughs> That looks yummy, well yummy that does. Guys, I've just got in from work. Hang on a minute. Hello Charlie, have you got that piggy again in your mouth? Wah. I've not even took my coat off, I am that hungry. This is what I've got for dinner tonight. So I've just been to Asda and got these um, pork loin steaks. So I'm having four of those, because I'm starving, I don't care. With uh, roast potatoes, carrots, peas, bit of gravy so I am that starving look coat on straight from work look what I got today though Lucy's undone it for me I bought myself a present I've treated myself all these long hours I thought do you know what I deserve it have a look at this I've just bought myself the new iPad Pro look at that do you know what this is I've not even undone the box and had a look at it myself I know Lucy set it up ready Oh, let's have a look at this. There it is. I just thought there was no home button on this. Wow, that is nice and thin, but that's what I've just bought myself anyway. So I can put a SIM card in it as well when I'm out and about. Um, yeah, so I've got that. That's my little present for all the hard work I do. I think I deserve it, definitely. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna get on with my dinner and I'll catch you in a little dinner, guys. So we've got roast potatoes, chardonnay, carrots, petit pois, peas, my pork loin steaks, bit of apple sauce, the gravy I've had to make from a chicken stock because I never had any gravy in the cupboard. That's not good, is it? Anyway, while my dinner's been cooking, I've been having a little play with this uh, iPad Pro. 
it is the absolute business look at that and the sound on it you got four speakers and it's so light I love it absolutely love it so that's what I'll be playing with later nothing else only the iPad anyway guys I'm gonna eat my dinner now I'll be back to you in a little while guys it's Friday night I'm gonna say the word I'm not gonna swear Jack thank that it's Friday don't you dare say the rest of the words it's been a hectic week considering I've been ill most of it I've had to have days off guys because I've been that ill there's Jack Jack I've got Dad's iPad, it's mine now. <laughs> it's got my new iPad Pro. 2020, look at the camera. He's playing a bit more than me. Let's go see what everyone else is doing. And what's Poppy and Shannon doing? Playing. What's the game called, Shazza? Frustration. Yes. Even though I'm not called Shazza. 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 What are you playing? Frustration. Yeah. yeah. We all ought to have a game of that. Oh, hang on, I can see a tail waggling in the background. Hello, Charlie, you're not playing frustration. You stay on your bed, Charles. Where you get Jimmy? Lucy's having a bath, so we're just basically just chilling out at the moment, aren't we, guys? You don't even got the telly on. Jack's been naughty and eating in my bedroom. As soon as my wardrobe comes, that will be it. We'll have all the, the iMac on the desk. Wait, where will you put the wardrobe? I'm, the wardrobe is going at this side, Jack, just here. So, my wardrobe that's taken two months to come. Well, it's not come. It's coming on the... It should be on between the 5th and 8th of October. It's a big sliding door, mirrored one. Love it. Um, so yeah, it should be here then, Lucy's got her desk coming, and then we're finished in the house, that is it, oh I've got to get a little desk for the iMac, and that is it, we are finished, so what I'm going to do then is a house tour for you guys, and I'm going to test my iPad out, and I'm going to do a live, I'll let you know when, but I'm going to do a live very shortly. In fact, I might do one once a week. I might get back into the old uh, live videos. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, I'm just going to have a bath now. And basically, I think the kids are going to play on the game. I'm just going to switch my telly on, do a bit of chilling out Guys, tonight. We've just got an email. We're going up to get the iPad case. With these two. <laughs> Jack, what do you think to Dad's new iPad? I love it. Jack's been on it all night, haven't you? Yes. <laughs> right. I've been on my iMac. Right, let's go then. Right, we've got the iPad case. Next stop is Asda. Unlock the car. Uh, next stop is Asda because we need to get bacon. We're going to have bacon sandwich for breakfast this morning, aren't we, guys? Yeah. We're back indoors now. I tell you what, guys, I'm not doing a lot today out there. It is absolutely freezing. Anyway, I'm just cooking our bit of... Uh, Breakfast, bacon sandwiches, smells lovely. Look at that. I'm gonna have egg. Do you want egg with yours? You don't like egg, do you, Jack? Uh -oh. That's what I always use. Look at this. I use always use a bit of fry light. Love it. Got the iPad case. <laughs> yeah, we've got the iPad case, haven't we, Jack? Yeah. Poppy's upstairs on the PlayStation. You notice today, everything runs around technology. Even if you're having a bacon sandwich, you've got to be on your iPad. I tell you what, it's a different era today to what it was when I was growing up. So you look, you've got to eat your bacon sandwich at your pops with an iPad. So it's Jack. Me and Jack's just chilling out, aren't we? Do you want hot dogs for your lunch today? Yeah. Gonna to do them some hot dogs. That's what the girls are playing. Is it frustration yes, you're playing? Dad. Oh look, talking of hot dogs. We got hot dogs, Charlie, today. Do you want a hot dog? <laughs> Charlie's face. Come on in here, Charlie. Silly. Just because I said hot dogs, I didn't mean you. Yeah, so the weather out there is absolutely dreadful. It's torrential rain. I'm just going to nip across the road. Just going to get the hot dog rolls in a minute. These turns after me. And uh, what are we doing today, Jack? Just sort of chilling out, aren't we? Yeah. 
I could actually go on a PlayStation. I don't mind a bit of PlayStation. Oh, got to pick Paul up later. He's coming for dinner as well. But yeah, it's just a lazy, chilled day. I know what we got to do. I've just remembered. We got sweet tasting in a little while. Mm. Oh, yeah. I'm up for that. Right, guys. Jack and Poppy have been dying to do this all morning. We have had a parcel sent from Snack Surprise UK. What they do is they send snack boxes to you. You can subscribe to them from all around the world, all different themed countries. And I've undone the box already. They haven't looked in it. Watch this. No looking. We have got snacks from Sweden. Right, who wants to look inside the box? Me. Right, what's in the snack box? What are they? What are they? Perhaps you've got to say as they come out. Um, noodles. I don't know. I can't read this. Ballerina. <laughs> right. Holly. Holly. What grill. are they? What are they? Chris Jack? Yeah, grill. It, tell, nah. it tells you on the actual. If you get this, the book that they sent. It tells you what each one is. Gary. I don't know how to pronounce it. Nugget. 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 Oh, I like the sound of that. 283. 283. Mmm. These are nice. <laughs> They are like a nugget with chocolate. What's your side, Jack? Your nugget. I haven't tried it yet. What do you think? Yeah, it's alright. What's your side, Pops? It's alright. Right, I'm going to try these sour cream and onion crisps. I, I love sour cream anyway. Oh yeah, look at them. Mmm. Mmm, these are nice. Yeah. No thanks. We don't like Chris. No. Really? No. Mmm. They're quite nice, isn't they? That's good. Mmm. Cheese noodles. Noodles. There you go. Right, so we've got the can of drink called Trocadero. I'm going to look in the book what it actually is. A classic, wonderful, refreshing drink flavoured with apple and orange. It was launched in Sweden in the early 50s. Do you want to try a drop of this, Jack, with me in a glass? Let's go and get a couple of glasses. Get another two glasses, Shazza. Go and get two glasses. Where's the glass? I ain't trying that. Cheers. What do you think, Shannon? That tastes actually not. Do you know what that reminds me of? Bing. Have you ever tried Bing from years ago? That is quite nice. I like that. Right, I'm going to try my Jack. Looks like a Mars bar. Right, we're going to now try the Dumbly Snacks. I'm going to see what it says. Chocolate and sweet toffee combined with crispy yeah, rice good. and give you energy when you need it. Send me a box of these. Definitely need yeah. that. Mmm. That is nice. What else we got? These. Open them. Then. What are you opening, Pops? Um. Grill. Grill? Yeah. Robust crisp for all onion lovers by the Esther of Ram. Mmm. 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 They're nice. Do you like them? Mm -hmm. They're nice. Right, biscuits. Let's, biscuits. Let's see what the biscuits are. Ballerina. Double vanilla biscuits with a lovely nugget 
filling. Ballerina is one of Sweden's most loved biscuits. Here you go, these are the most popular biscuits in Sweden. Right, these are one of Sweden's most popular biscuits, the ballerina. Everyone try, oh they look quite nice, look at that. Bit of chocolate in the middle as well. Mmm. What do you think, Pops? I haven't tried it yet. Mmm, I like them. What do you think, Jack? Mmm, they are. Big thumbs up on the biscuits. So we're now trying Cool Hallen Scale. Scum. Was that, did you like my Swedish accent bit then? Let's try, we'll, we'll see what these are like. Mmm! Pink sour skulls that taste like fresh picked raspberries. The chewiness is nothing short of a genius move. Mmm, they are really nice. Have you tried one, Pops? Mm, no, I haven't yet. Pops is eating a crisp. Mm -hmm. So, thanks very much Snack Surprise UK for sending these. I tell you what guys, it is fun trying all the different themes from another country. And I love the way that you've got a booklet to explain what it is. Highly, highly recommend it. Guys, I'm gonna stick their link uh, down below in the description. Well guys, I wanna say a big thanks to Snack Surprise UK. I tell you what, it's really nice trying all these different sweets around the world. I've got up this morning and I started talking Swedish, didn't I Lou? Yeah. It's all those Swedish sweets I've eaten. I need some Australian ones next. I'm gonna go around saying good day, mate. Good day. An American. An American. Yeah, <laughs> we'll have the old American accent going as well then. What's American accent then, Lou? I don't know. I should know, I lived out there for six months. I can't remember it now, but yeah, honestly, I loved those sweets, trying them. It's really nice, everything different around the world. The kids loved it as well. Thanks to you guys. Anyway, I'm gonna end the vlog now. I hope you're all having a good weekend. Weather conditions in Ramsgate, Kent are absolutely awful. It's uh, gale force winds, raining. I'm just about to start my Tesco campaign video for them. So please make sure you watch the next vlog and watch it for me. It's going to be American pancakes with blueberries, raspberries and I think it's maple syrup in it, Lou. Or syrup, isn't it? We couldn't get the maple syrup, could we? Yes. So that's what it's going to be. So watch the next vlog after this one, guys, and I'll catch you later. Bye.